guys, this is James from Tech Room Solution. In this video, guys, I'm going to show you the three ways on how to transfer WhatsApp messages from your Android phone to your iPhone. So, by the way, guys, if you like my video, hit thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more videos. You can also hit the notification bell to notify you every time I upload new videos. And, guys, always check the description box below for any updates about this video. So, let's go back to the video. As you can see guys, my Android phone to the left and my iPhone to the right. So the first method that I'm going to show you guys is to transfer WhatsApp message from Android to iPhone using email. So let's go to WhatsApp app in Android phone. Then select the conversation that you want to transfer. In this conversation guys, you can see that I have text and photo. So now to transfer, tap this three dot icon right here. More then export chat. So from here, you have two options, to transfer without media or include media. So it's up to you guys what you want to choose. So for me, I'm just going to choose without media. Then select Gmail. Then type your own email. And then send. Then in your iPhone, tap the receive email. So this is the email guys, attach is WhatsApp message from my Android. Tap the attach file. As you can see guys, this is plain text messages. The main disadvantage of this method is that your chat won't be visible in your iPhone WhatsApp messenger app. If you want to know how to transfer WhatsApp messages to your actual iPhone WhatsApp app, let's go to the next method. In this method guys, you need to download the software, which you can download in this website. I'm gonna put the link of this website in the description box so you can check it. You can download Windows or Mac version of this software. Download it and install it to your computer. Then after installation, open the software. Now guys, we need to perform some tasks in your Android phone before connecting to your computer. First, you need to enable the USB debugging in your device. To do that, go to settings, scroll, then developer options, then enable this USB debugging, then OK. If developer option is not available in your device, go to settings again, then about phone, software information, then tap the build number seven times next step is to back up your whatsapp chat to your local storage in your android device to do that go to whatsapp app tap this settings chats chat backup then make sure backup to google drive is set to never then hit backup final step guys is to go to your google drive you can also do this using your phone, but I'm going to do it in my computer. Click this, settings, manage apps, then disconnect the WhatsApp from Google Drive. Then you can now connect your Android phone to your computer. We already performed this instruction guys. Just hit OK. So this pop up guys, basically saying the software required older version of whatsapp app so for this you need to uninstall your whatsapp in your android hit ok and it's now installing the old version to your phone downgrade successful after the downgrade is complete run the modified whatsapp in your android and verify your phone number and restore the chats from the backup If you follow all the steps correctly guys, the software will display all your messages including media from your WhatsApp app.
Now select your Android device, then click backup messages button to backup all your WhatsApp chats to the local database of this software. But for now, we're just gonna backup the messages that I want to transfer. We are now about to connect our iPhone to computer. But before that, make sure that you now have active WhatsApp app with your phone number verified. You also need to encrypt your iPhone backup with the password from iTunes. For more details, click how to. Also iCloud backup and find my iPhone should also be disabled on your iPhone. The software is now detected my iPhone 11. Then now select the database that we made. Then click transfer messages from database to iPhone button. Then click confirm. Software now will transfer all the chats from the backup to your connected iPhone. Just wait patiently. So guys, transfer is complete. So I'm gonna open now my WhatsApp in my iPhone to check it. So guys, now you can see the messages that I transferred from my Android phone to my iPhone. So the last method guys is if you have Mac computer, then you can try this open source software called WhatsApp Android to iOS importer to transfer WhatsApp chats from Android to iPhone. Xcode should be installed on your Mac and entry level programming skills are required to use this software. If you are not tech savvy, then you might find it difficult to use. But it is free, so I thought of including it to my video. I don't have access to Mac right now, so I can't demonstrate how it works. So that's it guys, um, those are the three ways on how to transfer WhatsApp messages from your Android phone to your iPhone. So by the way guys, the software that we use in this video is not for free. Currently, there's no free software that you can use to transfer WhatsApp messages from Android phone to iPhone or even from iPhone to Android. You have to at least purchase the software to get the job done. So it's up to you guys. Also guys, if the software that we use in the second method doesn't work for you for any reason, then I've added similar software in the description box. So that's it guys. Um, if you like my video, hit thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Thank you for watching guys. Have a nice day and see you in my next video. Bye bye.